departed by Brandon Pickerel. I boarded the train at London Bridge. It was black with gold-lettered inscriptions, and handed the man my ticket stub as I made my way to a booth to sit in. He had a strange glint in his eyes, that bearded conductor with too tall a hat. I shook off the feeling as steam began to whistle, but deep down I knew I'd never come back. The locomotive howled like a raging banshee as the wheels turned over top the tracks. I peered out through the window in disbelief at the sights I witnessed beyond the smokestack. Days and nights flew by in an instant, winter's chill thawed, then leaves fell back to brown. The sights and towns that once I knew vanished before me till none were around. Then we began our furious descent, the wheels were chugging at thunderous pace. The cabin was shaking and all the lights flickered till we finally reached a stopping place. The ground was tinged with crimson red, a tall cypress tree distorted my view, and the air was thickened in foreboding haze, which displaced my wonderment with despair and gloom. All aboard! The conductor roared in otherworldly tone as a horde of ghouls and monsters made their way on. Vampires, werewolves, trolls, and orcs, Cerberus, chimeras, and leprechauns. Confused, I rushed to the conductor's cabin. Excuse me, sir, I choked with a frown. Let me stop you right there, he said with a devilish grin. I'm going to have to ask you to go sit down. What's the meaning of this, I shrieked in disbelief. I want to go home, I cried, dreary-hearted. There's only one destination for folks like you. And don't you see? You've already departed.